As you already know, we are sending scientists to the Altair system to investigate records found on Altair 4. Command hopes they will aid us in our war with the Shivans. The Rosetta is currently carrying the scientists. It will rendezvous with two transports, Omega-1 and Omega-2. All three ships should be arriving within a few minutes. Omega Wing will dock with the Rosetta as soon as they arrive. Oversee this personal transfer. Then escort Omega-1 and Omega-2 to the jump node. Alright, this doesn't sound all that difficult. We're just going to have to mind the kids, basically. I guess it all depends on what sort of resistance we're going to encounter. But on paper, it doesn't sound too tough. What might be tough is if we carry over our damage from the previous part of the mission. I'm out of missiles. Calling in a support ship. Which, unfortunately, we do. We are in a bad way. This is gonna be tough. Uh, I'm gonna need some new missiles as well, so let's do that. Roger, sir. On our way. We might also want to call in our reinforcements, Epsilon Wing, because we're pretty beat up. We'll hold off for now. But if it looks like we need a little more support, we can certainly do that. Alright, there is our friend, the Rosetta. We're going to have to take care of, of uh, that ship and the Omega-1 and 2 transports. I don't want to get too close to that spinny thing. It's kind of hard to see. Let's uh, just hang out here until we get rearmed. Hopefully we're not directly in the way of the Omega-1 and 2 transports and they're gonna crash into us. Enemy oh. wing has just arrived! All units, uh, engage at will. Engaging enemy. They were way ahead of me. Come on, support ship, hurry up. Alright, we're good, sir. go. There is a lot of carnage over there already. I missed it. I missed all the fun. Good job, guys. I'm glad you're on my team. Let's find the uh, important ships again. Enemy oh, more enemies. Just arrived. Never mind. That is a lot of explosions. It looks like they're all going to keep coming from the same direction, but I'm still going to sort of hang back a little. May reduce the number of kills I get, but somebody needs to stay near the important ships. Oh, they're right on top of us. Women all seem rather confused. Ouch. Alright, if it keeps up like this, we should be fine, despite our low hull integrity. Let's actually. Never mind. At, at some point. I want to give our guys the order to protect the Rosetta so that if they launch, you know, bombers who actually get missiles away, our wingmen will intercept said missiles. Let's try and be quick about this. I wish I could remember what button it was to select things out of my monitor monitoring list. But I don't. Roger that, sir. So I can't use it. It just saves us a little bit of time when cycling through. New bandits in the area. Hmm. 
Looks like my wingmen are not really engaging right now. Because they're trying to get closer to the Rosetta. But that's okay. Once they get close enough, they'll turn around, and they have. And then these guys don't really stand a chance. It's getting a little, uh, a little crowded, guys. Let's be careful. Somebody is well on fire. It looks like it's the Rosetta. It's got a little... a little flaming torch on the end of its spinning thing. It's like one of those, um... those fireworks. What do you call them? Uh... Catherine Wheel? I think? Maybe? I don't know. It's kind of a pathetic version, but... you get the idea. You guys are getting awfully close. Do be careful. Oh. Ah, God. I thought we were dead right there. Guys, please stop ramming into each other. Guys. So apparently we're supposed to be escorting Omega-1 back to the jump node. Where is Omega-1? Omega-2 docking completed. Proceeding to jump node. Alright, he's already out of here. Let's actually get Omega-2 and we'll tell Beta Wing to escort them yes, back. I don't know what they're equipped with. They may be... Whoops. Yeah, we're sending bombers to escort that guy, but... I think that'll be okay. That's the Lucifer arriving! Really? Oh, no. Alright, all all units, engage at will. Engaging enemy. Let's do what we can, which isn't much. But we gotta try. I feel bad for sending Bader all the way over there Enemy now. Has just arrived. The Lucifer is launching fighters at our transports. All right, we're gonna prioritize the fighters because we cannot hurt the Lucifer. I will reiterate: all units engage at will. Engaging now, sir. He's way over there, though. Whoops! I'm really twitchy today. There must be something wrong in my brain. I shouldn't even joke about that. That that would be bad. I'm gonna blame the caffeine. And hope I'm right. Anyway, let's focus on the task at hand. I don't think we're gonna be able to stop the loose for doing whatever it wants. Rosetta has safely made it back to Terran space. Good. At least we got the Rosetta out. But we still gotta get Omega-1 and Omega-2 to the jump node, and that is not gonna be easy. We're almost in range of the fighters now. And we're leading the charge. That's not a good idea. We're kind of wounded. Let's slow it down a little bit. I really keep twitching today. That is not good. I'm going to take my finger off the right mouse button. At least we can hurt the fighters, even if we can't hurt the Lucifer. So we can feel like we're doing something useful. 
These guys can turn around on a dime. They're not even dragon fighters. He is much faster than we are. Enemy wing has just arrived. Really? More fighters? Just what we need. I think I'm gonna make the decision that if we lose any fighters, I will call an Epsilon wing. Until then though, we're gonna do what we can. Come on, please die. Thank you. I completely lost track over what our uh, escorts are doing. Hopefully they're leaving. Won that game of chicken. Jumping out, sir. See you in Altair. All right, Omega One is clear. Omega Two is in trouble, though. Omega Two has taken a hell of a beating. Come on, jump out, Omega Two. Enemy wing just arrived. All right, you know what? Omega Two, where are you? Omega-2. All fighters protect Omega-2. That, that is your only goal in life right now, is to make sure Omega-2 gets out of here. Get back here. Find me like a man. You alien. Alright, gotcha. Lucifer does not appear to be shooting. That makes me feel happy. Maybe the transports are too small for the Lucifer to target them with its stupid OP beam weapons. Oh no. Omega 2 is fucked. It has one hit point left. Oh, thank god for that. Alright, just engage it, will, guys. Pilots, this mission is finished. Jump back to base. Alright, never mind. Get the hell out of here. I'm out of here. Everybody, go home. I think we got pretty we lucky there. To get both transports to the Altair system. If the information at Altair 4 proves as valuable as the Vesudan refugees suspect, then the Terran and Vesudan people will owe you a great debt. Well done, pilot. The crew of the Rosetta sends their thanks. When the Lucifer jumped in, they all but gave up hope of survival. Your squadron was able to hold off the enemy, and that is most impressive. For this, you are awarded the Commendation Medal. Yay, medals. I think that might be a new one. It is. Sweet. Goes in our collection. No recommendations. We could not have done better. I'm really surprised at how well we actually coped there, given we started the mission with 33 hit points and down a ship. But we managed it. Not 33 hit points. 33% hull integrity. Maybe we have 100 hit points, in which case that's accurate, but I don't think, I don't think that's how it works in this game. Anyway... Let's move on to the next one and hope it's something easy to take some of the load off. I don't think it will be. Oh, cutscene. There is little left for us, little time, but much irony. 
we did discover they are not invulnerable. The destroyers that darkened our skies like a plague can be harmed, but we have no way to deliver the hurt. We have the knowledge, but not the means. And so this is our legacy. In subspace, they cannot use their shields. And into subspace, they can be tracked. Okay, so in subspace, they can't use their shields. We're going to have to we try have and fight in subspace. We the records from Altair 4. They have been partially deciphered and are being moved back to Terran space. Omega Transports will once again be handling the movement of the scientists and the records. Unfortunately, the Altair system is still controlled by the Hammer of Light. Of course it is. One of their Fucking jerks. Ships, the Anvil, is stationed here and has gotten word of our presence in this system. It is currently blocking the vector to the subspace node. Alright, let's nuke them. The Anvil carries with it a powerful contingent of Asudan fighters. Intelligence reports two squadrons. One of advanced Toth space superiority fighters and one of Horus interceptors. These fighters have defended the anvil well. Intelligence has also detected the presence of a third wing of Asudan bombers in the system. They will undoubtedly try to attack our fleeing transports. Your strike force will once again consist of Alpha, Beta, and Gamma wings. Gamma will provide escort for Alpha, while Alpha attacks the Anvil. Beta will ensure the safety of the transports and maintain our fighter superiority. Alright, so it looks like we're going on a bombing run this time. The Anvil must be destroyed. We are equipping Alpha with Harbinger bombs. These bombs require exact placement and careful maneuvering, but will do massive damage to the Anvil. Beta and Gamma must ensure that the Harbingers reach their target. Our primary goal, however, is to ensure that Omega-1 and Omega-2 reach the jump node. Destroying the Anvil is the best way to ensure that this goal is accomplished. This mission is of grave importance. Do not fail, pilot. Good we'll luck. try. I'm sure we'll succeed. Maybe not the first time out, but that's the beauty of video games. We get to take multiple stabs at it. Before we get started, I'm a little concerned. If the hit points of our ships has carried over, uh, specifically Omega-2, they're not going to stand much of a chance, are they? Let's find out if uh, if we're fucked or not. Or we can crash. God damn it. 